Welcome back to Introduction to Engineering Design. This is Module 7.5, and again, we are making subassembly drawings, subassembly 3 this time. So what I've done is I've pulled my subassembly in, and you'll notice that I've got all these, uh, all of these planes and axes viewing here. And I want to turn that off for my drawing. So I want to go here and click Hide All Types, and I haven't really shown you how to do that yet. So we'll hide all types. Now I want to make a, well actually first I want to make a uh, view of this that is exploded. So I'm going to go here and right click on my default view, new exploded view. And I'm going to start my explosion steps. So start by pulling our uh, one block socket out. My two block socket out. And then I want to pull my passenger base out. And I want to pull this out a good little ways because I'm going to grab it twice here because it just doesn't do it justice to leave it sitting in there. Might be too far. There we go. All right, there is my exploded view. File, save. And now what I want to do is go file, make a drawing from the assembly. Browse to my IED template. And I'm going to place my isometric view. Isometric exploded view. Drop it in. It's at a 2 to 1. Shaded with corners. I'm going to go ahead and do my auto balloon. Pulls my balloons in. I'm now going to line my balloons up so they look a little better. I don't like that alignment at all. And there we go. Got my balloons in here. Next I'm going to add my bill of material. Annotation tab. Tables. Drop down. Bill of materials. Select the view. Parts only. Click the check mark. Drop it in. Edit. Item 1 is made out of wood. Item 4 is plastic. <clears throat> file. Save my drawing file. Save all. And then I want to go back and go File. Save as. I want to select PDF from my drop down. Save it <coughs> and exit. That was it. That was Sub Assembly 3. Thanks for watching.